Hi guys, it's Sally from Vintage Discoveries here with another mostly vintage, hopefully, bag haul, jewelry, and other stuff. Well, this isn't, I don't think, vintage, maybe, uh, $10 on sale for the Dolphin Clamper. It's in really good condition. I don't see any names except for me in Japan. Here's a really cool watch. I think the stone just fell out. I have it right here. As I was pulling it out, you can glue that back in. Kind of neat. Little flappers here. I like anything with um, it's kind of like lucite, especially with the texture. I wonder if I could rock that. Bonetto. Kind of like it. I have to make sure I don't lose the stone. Here's a big bird. Very heavy big pin that I can't imagine anybody wearing except for maybe Elizabeth Taylor. It's got some stones missing. And it's very big and some, some wear. So I think somebody wore that. Whoa, this, um, is this something that was on a belt maybe? I'm not sure, very heavy. I can't imagine wearing this on your waist, but what else would it be used for? Big. Might be Elizabeth Taylor's bag. And we have this little coin purse. It feels so nice. I love the feel of that. I'd love to have a dress made out of that. I bet they have it. It's in good condition. Let's see if the inside's dirty. Nope, it's not dirty. Check for anything. Mm, no diamonds. I think that's Whiting and Davis. Yes, they make a lot of these. It's in nice shape. I think maybe it's not change purse. Do you think it's for cigarettes or something? I don't know. This feels really good. Can't stop feeling it. Oh, I don't know what that. I think it was dirt that was coming out. Ugh. Here is, looks like a more modern bracelet. No name. Wear it either way. Kind of pretty. see what that looks like. It's kind of, um, I think this is plastic. Maybe plastic. Yeah. Nice beads. Well, this is like gold uh, paint on there, but this one doesn't look like it's gold. Is it gold paint? Yes, it is. Sorry. kind of like what you wouldn't want to see on a bar of soap. Let's just leave that there. I don't know why there was so much stuff coming out of that bag. I guess maybe it's deteriorating. I don't know. This is Roman Enhancer. That's a nice shape. Originally 1250 from Lex. I don't know, that's not, I've never seen that store in my life, so it must be from another state. Got some tangles. Got one of these. Ooh, pretty. I expect it to be the clear ones until I turned it around. 
Do we have all the stones? Let's see. Looks like it. Oh, these are nice Aurora Borealis. Green and blue. At the bottom end, yes. Ooh. Pretty and fancy. Very pretty. Who wear that for Christmas? Some faux type pearls, I would say. Definitely faux. Faulty strands, which hate me. Here we go. Faulty strand. This is newer, I guess. But I think these were made a while ago. I keep saying that they're modern, but you can have one that's older with that clasp, I think. I forgot the date. A nice little mix. Plastic beads. Little necklace. Nah, I didn't redo my nails. I need to, though. Do you see a marking on there, or is it just, no, not gold filled. Little, pretty little stone that used to, remember when these were really popular, the shape, the marquee? I always wanted a marquee wedding ring, engagement ring. Back in the day, you know, when you were a kid. Uh, LC, you know, I know what that is. You know what that is, but it escapes me right now. This feels very nice. Very nice chain. Kind of like the um, snaky. Very nice chain. Liz Claiborne. We. What's all over my fingers? Nice little chain in case I need one. This, I wonder if it's for this, if you would just put it through the things. This looks like an Avon thing to me, but it doesn't say Avon. I think Avon pretty much marks all of their items. For some reason, I'm just thinking this is what this is. Could be wrong. Could it be? It could. Stretchy beads. I assume faux pearls. Yeah, usually there's no markings when this is all open here because it'll be closed off and then you can see a little where it says gold or silver. And so these don't appear to be real. But they're glass, so they're kind of heavy. One down. Nice cuff bracelet. If you want to wear things that look like you have multiple bracelets, but doesn't go clangity clang. This is older because of the V shape. Does it say something or is it just scratched? Oh, it's just scratched up a little bit. Reminds me of a coral, but pretty. It's frosted and uh, shiny. Pretty bracelet, but it has missing stones. It's got some red and Aurora Borealis. This is heavy. Ooh. Heavy stretch bracelet. Nicely made though. It might be marked inside, sometimes they are. Ooh, yes. I think that says Monet. Yes, it is. Good call. Very heavy and nice. Very fancy. 
don't think it has any missing stones. So, whoa, if you could feel it, heavy, heavy. Glad to know this Monet, though. It's made very well. This is pretty. Enamel with some rhinestones and one missing, just one. That could be replaced. I don't see any name, which is surprising because it's, it's very nice. It's so small, I was wondering what it supposed to be that small or is it meant to be just on the wrist and sit like that? I don't know. But it's pretty. I like it. This is pretty. Very nice. I found something similar to this but they were broken at the bottom so that was a bummer but this looks to be all intact. It's got some with strands of the Aurora Borealis and some without. And it's really flowy. Very pretty. Very pretty. Oh, and it can be a necklace also. I don't see any name on it, which is surprising. It's got some wear. But doesn't affect the front. Except right there. Maybe where it was connected it might have a stone missing or is that just really dirty can't tell but it is very pretty these are fun fun clip on earrings oh I've had this before in blue I think they're West Germany or maybe Austria so I've had them in blue, but they were falling apart. Made in Austria, yeah. They're kind of like fireworks or... I don't know what they remind me of. But very pretty. I can't imagine wearing those. But I like them. This is plastic made to look like kind of um, freshwater pearls, but very lightweight plastic. Some shell bangles. A necklace with ball, silver balls. I don't know what it says. Oh, I've seen this name before. Deplaz. Has one of these type. I think you have to like squeeze it and pull it. Just silver beads. Heavy. Deplos. Here's another one. It's intact. Because I've seen it, like I told you before, the blue one's so pretty. But. So many missing ones on it, but these look in good shape. Like I told you before, I don't know where that came from. <laughs> Whoa, this is huge. Big. Oh, this is the. Oh, okay. This is the bale. Whoa. Maybe there was something around here. I can't tell if this is... Oh, it looks okay. Wow, look at that. That's big. Some more of those. Cuff bracelet. A little bit bent out of shape. Rings, rings, and more rings. It's a ring necklace. Yep, just a ring necklace. Lots of rings. I think I said that enough. I see animals. Animals. 
Vamos. Some animals. Animal necklace with wooden beads. I don't think it has a clasp. Nope. Is that a clasp? Nope, just beads. Does anybody like these? I love animals, but I don't think I would be wearing this anytime soon. Looks like it's hand done. This looks like a choker. With beads. Very heavy cloisonne type. Is that how you open it? Am I doing the wrong side? It's pretty with the butterflies. Nicely done. Am I doing this wrong? Ah, uh, hey, yeah, it's the other side. Oh, it's missing the safety chain. Pretty colors though. Part of a earring. Wreath. Super long necklace. This is vintage. Plastic beads, some crackle, but it's all plastic. Which I don't mind, don't get me wrong. I like some plastics. Cool. More bracelets. This is silver and gold. Little square beads. Kind of cool. I guess it's Napier. It's got some rough spots. Here's this. Oh, eyeball. Evil eye or something. More bangles. This is a pretty bracelet made in Western Germany. I love it actually because I love flowers and I love the colors and it fits me. Mm. It's got some wear on the edges. I don't know if that's purposefully or it's just worn. Oh, it's just worn. Well, I can't get rid of that. I have to wear it. The flowers are very pretty. Oh, like a Pegasus. Right? Look at this. I've seen these before. With different stones. Let's see. No name. Cool, I like those. This is an earring. A dangly one. Casey. Not to be confused with Casey and the Sunshine Band. I don't think. Ooh, look at this. This was some necklace. Has the attachment still here. Ooh, does that say something? Uh, doesn't it look like it said something? Or am I crazy? You're crazy. It's just worn. Okay. I wonder what the... It's probably was some beads or something. Some cool beads. Dang it. I can't get in there. Okay. Look at those. Wow. That was probably some kind of necklace. 
these are sewn, you know, I think these are sewn on. It feels like it. Somehow. Really cool. Another bangle. Oh, I already have this one. The Zavon. Very pretty. It's supposed to look like porcelain, but I think it's plastic. It's pretty though. This is Andover. Andover. I know it's an Andover, Massachusetts, and an Andover something else, isn't there? I have a few of these different colors. The glue is very badly done. This one's like a brown. I have, I think I have a red and a green. It's kind of cheaply made. What? What's this? Oh, earring. With a green stone looking thing. A little watch. I think this says Geneva. Right? Does it? I'm terrible. Yep. A little wiry thing, thin. It's a nice watch. Another watch. Timex. Who does it have one here? WC. Hmm. I've never seen. I guess that maybe it's the maker of the. Um, The watch band or something. Never seen it have initials there. Timex. Earring. Another watch. Fisher. Is it Fisker? Fisher? It's got some jewels, apparently. It says something jewels. I don't want to go backwards. 17 jewels. Oh. It's got that. Probably very fancy in its day. Hmm. Never heard that brand of um, watch before. Well, this is pretty. It's got a little issues there, but this is something right you put on um, a bunch of strands of pearls or what have you. Pretty enamel. This is an earring. Is it blurry or is it my eyesight? <gasps> See what happens when I try to fix things. Okay, we're all right, we're all right. Another earring to match that earring. Big dangly, got some leaves on it. This is kind of pretty. That's very nice. Woo! I hope I find the other one of these because it's, I like it. This, no name. Black and silver. The weird. Earring. Uh, like a chicken or something? Partridge? Something like that? Uh, ram? Goes with my man collection. Quarter. 
sports. I don't know what the word is there. So let's say Q, Q and Q. Q and Q. That's a new one for me too. I've never heard of Q and Q. Q and Q. I'll have to look that one up. It was really rough down there. All right. Oh, this is a shame. This is stuck in here. It's really stuck. Um, I think I've had something like this before. The middle part is missing. I think, I guess if you wanted to, you could put a, a pink stone there. I guess powder, part of the flower is missing. Oh, it's coral. Shoot, pretty. Um, this was a, um, an adjustable finger clock watch. Sheffield. I've seen that brand of watch before. But it's nicely made down here for an adjustable. This the other earring. Kind of weird. Is that a fish? Hold on. I have to know. Yes. A fish. This is a piece of fabric. This is a no-name kind of cheapy watch. I got a bunch of these um, in different colors, really fun colors from Michael's the craft store. Just to, I don't know where. They're kind of pretty. Oh, here's another eyeball. They have these at Michael's for craft projects. This is some rhinestones on fabric. Maybe it was part of clothing. It looks old and it's very heavy. Oh! That's pretty neat. These flowers remind me of my childhood. I don't see any name. Probably missing some flowers. I wonder if you could take these out. I'm not going to attempt that. No, maybe they came with it. Cool. We'll put that to the side because I don't want the flowers to break. Ooh, this is a lot of beads. It's a lot of beads. I think this is a more modern. Yeah. A lot of beads. Pretty color combo though. This is cool. I like these beads at the end. Ooh. Kind of trashed on that side, but I like the style of this. I don't know if that's glass or stone. It's got some red paint. It's glass. Not neat. It's something I would wear. It needs to be cleaned up. No, that's not blood. It wouldn't be red. Just needs to be cleaned up, but I like that style. I love it. No name watch, very rubbery type. Another watch from Pulsar. Let's just dump this out and get it over with on that. Um, another Pulsar goes on my watch bag. Ooh, tricolor. Remember that. And that was popular. Everything tricolored. Yeah. Maybe I could bring this back. Bring back the tricolor. Maybe not. 
I see a big pendant and it is a Roadrunner. Meep meep. Is there a name on it? Nope. That's a big, big Roadrunner. You have to love a Roadrunner to wear that. That's what I say. Oh, I have one of these. It's got wear on it. It's a pin and it's also a pendant. But I do have one that's got the chain attached and I have a, it's in a box. I don't know if it's a bear or if it's something else. Hmm. Beaded chains. Two dollars from Disney. Disney. It's also eleven ninety five Disney. Hmm. What is this? This is plastic. It looks like the bottom of a plastic spoon. And somebody was getting creative. Interesting. Just a little chain and some flowers from that brooch. Oh, I had one of these. I actually sold it. It's got some crud on it. I don't know what that is. She's not in good shape. Made in Taiwan, Republic of China. Yeah, she's in rough shape. I think. All right. This is interesting. Uh it's a little, uh, little birdie necklace. This is like leather. Oh. Yeah. Oh, birdie. I'll just put that to the side. Way, way over there. Okay. Plastic little pendant. Little metal heart. Red earrings. They look like ceramic. Let's see if we can. Feels like some kind of ceramic, yeah. Very pretty. Don't know what those symbols are or if they're anything. Yes, like porcelain. Does it say something on there? No. I feel like it does, but that won't be the first time that I am wrong. No, it's just a bunch of marks from where. But I love the ceramic. I love the color too and the feel of them. Very pretty. A little copper bracelet. Lots of wear. I think that's copper. Leaf and um, are these acorns? Or hazelnuts. I guess they're acorns. Oh, this is old. If I'm not wrong, this is old. With a double O. Old. Wow. Don't know what the leaves are made out of. Little acorns. 
That's an acorn, yeah. Oh, makes me kind of want fall. Not yet. I'm enjoying the summer, but I love fall. Christian Dior. Ooh, they're beat up. Oh, another just pendant. A hoop. Lots of stuff attached to this, and it's Trafari. There we go. This is very pretty. Hope I can find the other one of this. Heavy, but very pretty. Let's take a look. Uh, pocket watch. Made in China. Big diamond ring. I think this is Girl Scouts. Yep. Interesting earring. In bad shape, but cool design. It's very worn. Another watch. This says quartz. Big button earring. I guess that's like a bull with the horns. Very old um, locket. Oh my goodness. <gasps> oh no. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That's somebody's hair. Oh, 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 oh. I want to see what this says. Oh my gosh. Uh, mm, I love you. Oh my goodness. Oh my. How old is this? I guess a, maybe a girl gave it to, uh, or a, I don't know. No, this wouldn't be something a boy is going to wear. Oh my goodness, okay. Very worn copper thing. Bracelet, never would wear that. Weighs a ton. Ooh, look at this. Old, old celluloid. Oh, look, I cleaned that before it gets worse. Celluloid pin. Very nice. That's old. St. Anthony, pray for me. PGR. Interesting earring. The way those things are on there. This is um, patent pending, like a school ring. I don't know what that says. SP something stone, keystone. Hmm. Sarah. Hmm. To look more into that because I'm not. Easton. It says Easton. Something Easton High. Hmm. No, let's put that to the side. Ooh, the ring. Uh, 
That's a name, right? What does it say? Oh, for goodness sakes. Is it Monet or is it? Oh, this is terrible. Very pretty. It might be Monet. Very pretty. Oh, green. Weird pendant. Pretty religious um, pendant. It's pretty. Is it part of an earring? A little crappy ring. Don't know. Is this like one of those ear things? Like ear cuffs? Uh. Oh, that's really old. It's it's just cheap, but it's it's old. Oh, this is pretty. Not that. This. This had something nice in it. What I don't know. But I just like the way it looks. It's very pretty. Very pretty. As far as that school ring goes, I don't know. Uh, Chrysler, I believe? An earring. A little earring. Worn ring, Trafari earring. We have the other one. A bunch of these little rings. One of these. Look at little rings in here. It's like a um, hair clip, I assume. I will raise you up. This is an earring. Oh, wow, this is old. Something gold, I don't know. Solid. Dirty gold. So cool. It's got a little notch missing. I don't know if that's damage or somebody tried to test it crudely. I wonder how old it is. It just feels very old. This was part of a watch or something. Can't read what that is. Colburn? Calibor? Oh. That was nice enamel, but it's broken up. This looks kind of Avon to me, but... I don't know if I could clean it up or if it's just permanently crap. Eden? Is this like a dog tag or something? Oh, here's another one of those things. Bunch of weird little rings. Earring? Chrysler with a number? Part of an earring, I'm assuming. Yep, 
Yamaha, Chrysler, old broken up ring, St. Christopher, protect us, I don't know what that says, oh gosh. Well, I guess it's the maker. It's got a bunch of numbers on the back. That's like a can of machine kind of thing. What are those? Sweater clips or fur clips? hope I can find the other one because I had um, a brooch exactly the same thing I sold it oh I hope I find the other one it's so pretty little key best oh a frog a little shiny butt religious Symbol. Cheerleader with weird leg. Oh, there. Little broken gold stone. Cute little heart. Saint. Yeah, who? Demfina? Dem... Demfina. Pray for us. I haven't heard that one before. Oh, a little whale. That's an old ring. What does this belong? It belongs on something. Old cufflink. Wow. And a hook on something. Little moon glowy thing. And another earring. Oh, it says something. Old field. Oh, I have the other one, I think, somewhere. Oh, did I lose that stone for the watch? Shoot. Oh, it's probably over here somewhere. Okay, another one. Kind of thrown off by that finding that hair and the thing and so personal, you know. The I love you thing and the yikes. I guess this is a pendant and a pin. This is glass beads. Got some vertigray on there. Cute. It's so pretty in the back. It's a sweater clip or fur clip, I can't tell the difference. But I just I love that style, the the way that it has the the detailing. So pretty. Stretch bracelet. Ooh, groovy earrings. Sloppily done. 
Oh, big heavy. Heavy, heavy. One of these. Like a breastplate type. Interesting. This is super duper heavy. Very, very heavy. It's a newer model. Oh, it's got fabric in it. It's kind of odd. I think I have this one. Might be Sarah covered tree or I don't know, but I think I definitely have this one. Trafari. Earrings. Primavera. Six dollars. Two birdies. It's like pewter. I think I've seen this one before. It's missing the um, the flower. There's a gold tone flower that goes on here. But this looks cute without the flower. It looks like they're holding a, a love note or a heart. But that's not the complete pen. Oh boy. This, I feel like I've found something like this before. I could take an eye out with this. These are cute. Maravella White Luster. 35 bucks. Marshalls, $4.99. It's kind of nice. Oh, it's got some issues on the back. Ooh. Oh, here's the other one. There's two. Pretty. The pearls are missing. This is nice. No stones missing. No name. Pretty. Multi chain necklace. I'm not going to try to. Get that crazy. Oh, it's very stretchy. Very stretched out. I hear a clippy thing. Another stretchy, very stretched out. And I have one more we have time for. Oh, it's very big, very big and broken. Wow, is that a fish or an eagle or um? Almost reminds me of a squid. A squid. Made out of some kind of stone. Um, I think this is Tiger's Eye. It's missing the other part. That's interesting. I can't figure out what it is. I'm not good at this. Sometimes. Big brooch. No name. Reminds me of an eel. Ooh, this. Oh. Looks like there was something right here. Oh, how pretty. It's got a big, big safety chain.
This looks very old. Oh, Whiting and Davis, right? Yep. Wow, cool. I wonder what was on here. It was probably so gorgeous. Did I do that right? Because look at that. It's just something right here. Must have been amazing. So pretty. Hmm. That's shell. Was this an, like an owl's head? Are those opals? I think those are opals. What the heck was this? I don't know what this material is. But that looks like a piece of some sort of shell. And those look like really nice opals. Hmm. That's interesting. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, it's a pin. Reminds me of the tree topper. It's pretty. This looks like a faux turquoise necklace. It's older though. It's not bad looking. multi-chain necklace and it's from what does that say it's not Monet is it just to, yeah, I guess it's when it's written very differently. Multiple chains of gold. Pretty. This is cool. I think that's Trifori. Is that the newer Trifori symbol? It's plastic, but it's cute. A pretty green butterfly from, I think this is Park Lane or Thailand or something. Thailand, I was right. A plastic necklace, vintage plastic, plastic necklace, groovy, pretty cool, and it's pretty cool. You know, I wouldn't expect this necklace to have because it's not, it's not even attached. This is separate. I thought it was the other end of this necklace. <laughs> it's dirty. This is a bracelet. Sillies. Just a bracelet. No name. I really, I'm sorry. <laughs> ay, 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 ay. I gotta get a new tripod been bent too many times. This looks familiar. I have something like this. I don't understand if it's a... I think that's that flower. Is that a horseshoe or is it... I guess it's for keys? I'm not sure. 
Look at this mushroom. How cute. So 60s, 70s, right? Cute. Whoa. Whoa, I don't know if somebody made this. It's got wooden things on it. That's humongous. Humongous. This looks like. I'm going to say Avon. Yep. And that's supposed to be like this. Oh, okay. It's got a dark stone and some other beads, but I think it's real freshwater pearls. That's pretty. Okay, the end of the line. Clamper bracelet. Pretty. Earring. The Christmas watch, I'm going to say. Uh, let's see what's the name. Is it La Baron? La something. It looks Christmassy to me. Does it have all that stone? Yep. Reminds me of Christmas. It's cute. Uh, earring with somebody's initials. What is this? Oh. It's a necklace. Oh, it was tinsel. And what bag would be complete without the pearl sewn, I don't know what you would call these. I guess they were popular at one time. You never know if they'll come back. Who knows? But that's it, guys. Um, thanks for joining me. And I will be doing my Sabres Haul video soon. Um, I just got to get it all together. Because I separated some things, I washed some things, and some things I wanted to keep, so I just separate them. I got to get them back all together and show you what I got. I had a trip without you guys too. Um, took my husband with me and we got some stuff. Um, but I think I'm going to mainly concentrate on glass maybe because I'm really intrigued by some glass items because if I start picking up just everything willy-nilly um, that catches my eye, I will be drowning in it just like I am with jewelry. So I have to be cautious about that. But Thanks for joining me. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you don't uh, didn't already. But I appreciate everybody watching and commenting and liking and subscribing. I really appreciate it. And I hope you're having as much fun as I am. And I'll see you in the next video. And have a good night or a good day whenever you're watching this. Thanks. Bye.